All right. <laughs> All right, folks, so you missed what just happened, but Tess asked me if I want some water. Hello. She knows the rules. No eating or drinking anything for one hour to be a heavyweight. So no water. But here's the deal. I think I can make it. I know the secret. In my last video, I talked about the rules. Uh, here, we're gonna go again. So Pocky makes this one chip challenge. And we get this coffin that has, believe it or not, a beautiful Pocky chip. You'll see that in a moment. But that's just a, what do we call that? Foreshadowing of what's to come. So if I get through this challenge, at the end of it, I get to display this wonderful banner, 2020. We gotta do this before the year is over. But I just wanted to give you a little bit of a, an analysis of what we're gonna go through. Uh, so again, as I mentioned, heavyweight, I gotta do this for one hour without eating or drinking anything. And I believe that if I do that, I'm gonna be Mike, because I don't think he did it for an hour. So that's my goal. We'll see. Mike, you're gonna watch this, so we'll see what happens. All right, it says, do you dare to go head to head with the Reaper? Here are the rules. Number one, eat the entire chip. Number two, wait as long as possible before eating or drinking anything. And number three, post your reaction on social media with the one chip challenge hashtag and mention Pocky Chips. I don't know if I'm gonna do that unless they have some incentives for me, but we'll see. All right, here's what to expect. All right, with these, this chip is made with Carolina Reaper, which is apparently one of the hottest peppers in the world. Scorpion peppers, Szechuan peppers. This chip was created for the sheer pleasure of intense heat and pain. I'm a glutton for punishment. All right, so we've got five rounds. And this is what we should expect. Round one, a spicy punch to the tongue. Round two, a fiery jab to the face. Round three, impaired vision from tears. And this is, I think, the one that got Mike. He'd never felt that in his eyes before. I can't wait for that. Number four, round four, a light blow to the gut. And number five, knockout. And I don't know what they mean by this, but my guess is it has something to do with when the chip comes out. All right, that's it. It's time to bust in to the challenge. There's someone I saw on video who I think ate 57 of these at once, but they didn't have a reaction to capsaicin, which is the active ingredient in hot chili peppers. So I think I actually will I will have a problem with hot peppers here, but there's nothing that's too hot for me. Here we go. All right, I accidentally broke the tip of the chip off when I was unpackaging it, but doesn't this look intimidating? <laughs> Looks like something that came out of an Aztec ruin, right? All right, so this is it. Uh, I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> I just realized Tess is over here videoing from the side view. All right, here we go. I'm gonna go with a little bit first. I have one hour before I can become a heavyweight and prove my chili eating status. All right, here we go. What are the rules? I gotta check them. I gotta see how I... Mike said he just chewed on this for a while. It says, eat the entire chip. All right, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna chew on it because I think that's fair. I feel like something's brewing. There's absolutely nothing happening in my mouth right now. It doesn't even have a flavor, but I can sense something's happening. Mmm. Mmm. I shouldn't have got it on my lips. I know that's a mistake. Woo! All right. So it's not that bad, but it is true. First off, the tongue, powerful.
<laughs> so I almost don't want to talk because it's hard because it's true my tongue hurts ah. <laughs> I'll say it is a little bit different than anything I've had before because it's very lingering. It's almost like it has oil in it. It's just sitting on every um, every taste bud on my tongue and just kind of uh, poking it and prodding at it. But I honestly believe that I'm going to survive this because the tongue sensation is starting to elapse. However, that's just round one. Uh, next, I'm supposed to accept or expect a fiery jab to the face. <laughs> oh, did we actually capture the time we started this at? I have a timer. Where are we at? Three or four minutes. <laughs> All right, so we're three or four minutes in. Not a problem. Hey, that's Tess, by the way. Ah! Um, <laughs> uh, we came down to uh, Sonora, Mexico. Uh, I didn't know I was gonna have the chip down here, but. <laughs> But yeah. So that's Tess. We spent the day at the beach today. Tess, do you have anything to say? Come on, this is your social media moment. Francisco is sweating <laughs> a lot. I, I visibly can see some, some sweat all over his forehead, nose, and close to his mouth. Um, I'm not sure why what one would want to partake in this activity. But I think he's going to get through it. He's going to power through this. This is not the hardest thing he's ever done in his life. And he's going to use yogic breathing to, to fully use that breath and relax himself into this moment and the, these punches. That's my guest host, Tess, and I love her. She's <laughs> amazing. We met uh, about... Th well, I'll keep you in here. Four. met about... Four? For my talk show. Four years, uh, yeah. That's Pepper Talk Show. I don't know if you ever remember Kramer on the Seinfeld, but he decided to turn his living room into a talk show. And that's what we're gonna do today. Uh, so, Francisco, how are you feeling? I feel great, I really do. I didn't feel, uh, I do, I, maybe I do feel it in my face. So maybe we're in, in round two still. Should we zoom in on your face and let everybody see the sweat? In yeah, it? let's see what's going on in here, okay. Moist. No boogers yet, but my hair, I got a haircut today. <sighs> it took me about three hours to find an open barber shop, but we're not gonna talk about that right now. <clears throat> I actually feel like it's starting to subside the pain. You only have 54 minutes to go. Uh, well, uh, this is where <laughs> the chip will lose the challenge, and now my patience takes over. Uh, I don't think, I don't know if there's going to be anything else that's going to happen that's bad, but everything is starting to subside. My tongue is still, you know, still feeling a little bit of tingle, but I mean, it's still painful in my mouth. Uh, but... It's starting to chill out a little bit. Uh, where are we at in time? Seven minutes. <laughs> All right. So I've reached featherweight status, which is 
Five minutes. I, I, uh, I'm hoping I don't experience the whole uh, third point, which they say is uh, uh, impaired vision from tears. I'm just gonna sit here and wait patiently for that to happen. I have to admit that uh, I'm really feeling like I just like to drink a uh, drink of water or actually uh, I think Tess had a Coca-Cola here earlier. Uh, Mexican, Mexican Coke. Coke. <laughs> I don't know if she was trying to tempt me or what. That was... <clears throat> All right, I did feel something went down my throat just now and it was like, okay, now my throat's starting to feel a little bit of like craziness and the back of my, my throat is now starting to partake in the action. So it's an interesting pepper. Uh, it's, <laughs> oh, it's, it's a number of peppers, but I don't think I've ever experienced anything quite like that where it's, it, it's like absolutely nothing for about a minute. And then it just comes in. So there's some science behind that. But uh, I think I'm going to survive. Hey, Tess, do you think you might be able to get me some toilet paper so I can just like wipe my nose down? Sure. Thank you. I don't know. I just didn't want to leave the video frame. I don't want you to think that I'm leaving to go have a drink of water. <clears throat> you know, these days... Uh, it's hard to realize what the truth is. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could even probably video edit this, but I'm not a cheater. We also don't know that technology. I think, right? <laughs> I also do. <laughs> she, she knows me. I also don't even know how to how to do that. But uh, but I need to learn well, how to. You're almost. Oh. We have achieved lightweight status. Ten minutes. <laughs> oh, featherweight to lightweight. All right. So we are. What is that? Uh, Ten oh, out of sixty. Is, one is the boxer, right? So he's the fighter. Oh yeah. Hockey. I think that's probably oh, versus the nephew. That's all the rules. Ah, that makes sense. Those Hockey. rounds. So, we are at lightweight status, two more to go, the next will not be for another 20 minutes. But I just had to burp a little bit, but it's a little gas, nothing big. Let's check in, how are you feeling? Alright, so now, it's kind of, my tongue is gray, my face is gray, I actually feel it right here, on the outside of my, my face, and uh, the heat is starting to permeate. It's like kind of going here and here and like there, very mildly, like just a gentle massage, but it's kind of like a warm massage. It's kind of penetrating the body in these spots. What I recall from watching the video of Mike is that I think that his eyes at this point were already immediately having a reaction and I don't think that's gonna happen to me but maybe because it's actually it was here and I was like traveling to here so maybe it's finding its way right to here we'll see give it some time pretty weird did Mike give you this chip yeah <laughs> oh yeah so I would like to take a moment to thank the sponsors of today's challenge Michael Bruce Misty Bruce always amazing supporters of the cause <laughs> but uh, Mike went to the local Kroger Smith store and bought six of these chips I don't know if he was stocking up so that he could like try to eat all of them at once or what but uh, I was fortunate to be the benefactor of one of these chips and I'll have to admit that this has been really great thank you Mike thank you Misty thanks for getting me into this uh, <laughs> It says, warning. It hurts.
hurts like hell. Uh, if that's what hell feels like, I think I am going to uh, survive. Oh, well, let's say their tortilla chips are gluten-free, non-GMO, and come in five mouth-watering flavors. Wow, great. All right, so here's the deal. I, I like to talk and talk and talk all the time. I do it, but I don't think I can be that entertaining for the next hour. So I'm going to put a pause on this video. I'm going to ask Tess to be my integrity check. And we're gonna check in in about where were we at? We are at forty-seven. We have 47. forty-seven and a half minutes. Yeah. We'll check back in and see how been, how that went. It's been thirteen minutes. So right now I'm just gonna pause the video and we'll get right back. Uh, we'll really get back great. At, maybe at the thirty-minute round so that we can check in as middleweight status. All right, updating in thirty minutes. See y'all soon. Action! All right, here we are. We just made it to the thirty-minute point, and I'm happy to say that. Uh, since I left you last, uh, not much has happened. I probably sat there and waited on the couch for about five minutes with my cheeks kind of just feeling very warm. Uh, and then Tess and I just got into some conversation about, I don't know what I was explaining, but I'm always babbling. But Tess is going to verify that that was all solid. I didn't drink anything. I didn't eat anything. Tess, can you confirm that? Let's confirm if we can see the timer here. Oh, oh no. Nope. can't. Right, hold on, hold on. We can see a forest. There we go. All right. So There's the timer of how much time he has left until one hour. All right. But I've made an executive decision. I'm not going to go that long. I don't think I'm going to feel any more from this pepper. So I love to be a heavyweight. I really do, but I don't have the patience because I'm hungry for some split meat pea soup. So today I am going to settle for... No, you have to go the full hour. <sighs> I did tell I did tell Tess to... Okay, he's going the full hour, 29 minutes. <laughs> I did tell her to encourage me to finish this, so I'm going to do it. Just because... we. <laughs> that's what I was just talking about. I was just talking about adversity and persevering through challenges. So this is a lesson. Putting my money where my, my mouth is. All right, here we go. See you in 30 minutes, but it's almost going to be an instant flash for you. Lucky you. <laughs> All right, everybody, welcome back. So yeah, Tess alerted me, it's time. So guess what that means? Bum, 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 bum. One chip challenge champion, and we made it for an hour. So here we go. We have achieved. I know it's hard. I haven't figured out how quite to get this to the zoom right there, but there we go. One hour. Thanks, folks, for watching. I appreciate your interest. Uh, can't wait to see you again soon. Thanks again to our sponsors, Upgrade Taos Computer Solutions. Thank you, Mike and Misty. I uh, hope to see you very soon. Good night.